Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install Oracle VirtualBox on your Windows 10 operating system. So Oracle VirtualBox is a free and open source hosted hypervisor for virtualization. In other words, VirtualBox allows you to install many operating systems virtually on your host operating system. So let's say I want to install uh, Ubuntu operating system virtually on my Windows operating system, I can do that using VirtualBox. So for installing VirtualBox, just open your favorite browser and search for VirtualBox. And the first link which will appear here will be from virtualbox.org. So we are going to just click on this link. So once this website opens, if you are not uh, directly uh, redirected to the downloads page, you can click on this downloads link and you will be able to see uh, this kind of uh, downloads interface. We want to download uh, uh, the virtual box for Windows. So we are going to select uh, Windows hosts. And once you click on that link, you can see the download of this virtual box exe has been started, which is around 108 megabyte. So once this executable file is downloaded, I'm going to just click on this executable file and I'm going to just minimize the browser. The first window looks like this. So I'm going to just click on the next button here. And this is the location where your virtual box will be installed. So if you don't have the good reason to change this path, just go ahead and click next and just leave everything as default, click next and then click yes and then click install which is going to start the process of installing the VirtualBox on your Windows operating system. In between, you will see these kind of messages which will ask you to install some device related software. So I'm going to just click on uh, install. And then you can see straight away here, this Oracle uh, VirtualBox icon is created. And after some time, you will also see this message which says uh, the installation of uh, VirtualBox is complete and just leave this uh, checkbox checked which is going to launch your virtual box after you close that window so this is how virtual box looks like you can uh, close it and i'm going to once again open it using this icon so on virtual box you can create any uh, virtual machine by just clicking on this new button here and you can uh, see there are a different type of virtual machine you can create. For example, uh, Windows, Linux, Solaris, BSD, IBM, Mac OS and other. So let's say I want to just install Ubuntu. I will just type uh, Ubuntu here and you can see this type is Linux. And from here you can choose the version of Ubuntu you want to install. So you can choose 32 bit or 64 bit and then go to the next step and then uh, you can choose uh, the other options like uh, memory and uh, the processors and other uh, things right the most important thing you need to have to install a virtual machine on your uh, host operating system is the iso file so you can download for example the ubuntu desktop iso file from the ubuntu website and then you can uh, just uh, use that ISO file to create a uh, Ubuntu virtual machine, which will allow you to uh, create Ubuntu virtual machine and work with Ubuntu on your Windows operating system. So this is how you can download and install VirtualBox on your Windows operating system. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I will see you in the next video.